Tesla Giga Shanghai had an impressive year, friends. It produced over 400,000 electric vehicles by Tesla in the 11th month of 2021. This is up 242% year over year. Welcome back, friends. This is Armin Haryan from TorqueNews.com. If you are here new, please subscribe to our channel for daily cool Tesla discussions and ring the bell so you don't miss my next coverage and give us thumbs up, please, if you found this report informative. So, Tesla Giga Shanghai has produced over 400,000 electric Tesla vehicles in the first 11 months of 2021, moving confidently towards the set targets. This number of vehicles sold shows that the factory has increased its production figures by, look at this, 242% compared to the same period last year. Tesla Giga Shanghai continues to actively ramp up its production to meet the rapidly growing demand for the manufacturer's electric vehicles, notes Tesmanian. Eva Fox in the Tesmanian says, although Tesla did not give production forecasts for 2021, reports emerged earlier this year that Gigafactory Shanghai will aim to produce 450,000 vehicles. According to the information on deliveries that is already available, the factory not only fulfilled but also exceeded the intended plan for Giga Shanghai. I think Giga Shanghai is going to have another recorded year that will exceed expectation. As soon as the delivery data for November was released, it became clear that in the first 11 months of this year, Tesla Giga Giga Shanghai delivered 413,283 electric vehicles, up 242% from the same period last year. Thus, the factory will easily exceed the forecast that was made at the beginning of the year. In early December, Tesmanian reported that Grace Tao, vice president of Tesla China, said in an interview that Giga Shanghai could reach its 500,000 vehicle production target this year. For this, the factory will have to produce almost 87,000 cars, which seems unlikely. Nevertheless, Tesla is always full of surprises, so we should wait for the final numbers before drawing conclusions. It should be kept in mind, however, that Giga Shanghai has already achieved impressive production figures considering it has only been in operation for two years. Wherever, uh, whatever the final numbers are, they already are very high, especially for a new venture and will play a key role in Tesla's delivery rates in 2021. And as previous report by a Manager Gary Black said Tesla Gigafactory Shanghai, uh, when, once the Gigafactory Austin and Giga Berlin come into operation, they will have similar capacity of cars produced the same year as Gigafactory Shanghai did on the first year. This is Armin Haryan from TorqueNews.com. Please subscribe to our channel for daily Tesla discussions, several Tesla and electric vehicle stories. God bless you, everyone. Give us thumbs up if you found this report helpful. Have a wonderful rest of the day. God bless you. And let's move on to our next Tesla story. Big changes are awaiting for Tesla in 2022. Tesla could deliver 1.5 million cars in 2022 with 2021 start of production at Giga Texas and Giga Berlin. How likely are that the production of Giga Berlin and Giga Texas will start in 2021? I don't know and I would like to hear you friends in the comment section. But if things happen this way or at least in early January immediate start, we're talking about 1.5 million cars in 2022 reports Eva uh, Fox in the test mine. I will tell you more in details. This is Armin Haryan. Please subscribe to our channel for daily several Tesla electric week stories, uh, electric car stories. Big changes are coming for Tesla or waiting for Tesla in 2022. As the company car maker will begin mass production at two new factories, which will entail a major increase in overall production capacity. Information from a manager of the company hints that next year, Tesla will be able to achieve production of 1.5 million vehicles as well as develop in many other directions. What directions? Or okay, here's what's happening. Managing partner at the Future Fund LLC, Gary Black, tweeted that his company met with a Tesla manager on December 8th. After this meeting, the analyst shared some general thoughts that came up for him. Okay, here they are. First, 
black deliveries are uh, actually black believes that the manufacturers new factories giga texas and giga berlin will open with limited production before the end of 2021 so we have 19 or 20 days to go let's see how that goes in fact this is in line with tesla's general expectations giga texas is already in its final stages while giga berlin is only awaiting final environmental approval which may come within days if nothing bad happens. The analyst also expects that in the first year of operation, both of the new factories of the manufacturer Tesla will have a production volume and gross, pro gross profit percentage similar to the first year of operation at Giga Shanghai. If that happens, that's great success for Tesla. Second, Black is confident that Tesla can deliver 1.5 million electric vehicles in 2022 if battery uh, availability allows. This number coincides with the opinion of New Street research analyst Pierre Ferragu, who raised his price target for Tesla to $1,580, becoming the highest on street. It's worth noting that Wall Street currently expects Tesla on average to be able to deliver about 1.27 million electric vehicles in 2025 and 2022, 1,270,000. But these analysts are thinking one, one and a half million electric cars. Black wrote that the expansion of Tesla's production capacity next year will come from the expansion of Giga Shanghai as well as the start and ramp up of production at Giga Texas and Giga Berlin. In addition, he indicated that Tesla is planning new locations which should also play a role in expanding production capacity. It is currently unknown where a new plant or plants would be exactly, but rumors that the manufacturer Tesla is planning a factory in India have been circulating in the community for some time now. In addition, the analyst wrote that the production and start of deliveries of Cybertruck is being prepared for late 2022. As Tesla CEO Elon Musk said earlier, the electric pickup truck will have many new technologies which will significantly complicate production. However, once Cybertruck comes out, it will undeniably be exactly that, a product worth of a such long wait. Here's what Gary uh, Black wrote. We met with Tesla management yesterday. Thoughts. One, Austin and Berlin likely to open with limited production before year end. Second, Austin and Berlin year one volumes and GMs should be similar to Shanghai year one. Three, we have confidence uh, FY22 deliveries will approximately be, that means um, year 2022 deliveries will approximately be 1.5 million street expectation is 1.27 million battery capacity per meeting. Fourth point, Cybertruck on track for late 2022 start of production and deliveries. Fifth point, capacity expansion required will be via Shanghai, Austin, Berlin, expansion first, plus new locations. That means new gigafactories. Tesla IR is meeting with buy side investment team via virtual one on ones at the Deutsche Bank Auto Conf today. That's Gary Black's tweet, and I will have that link of that tweet in the description of this video, friends. Let me know your thoughts. What do you think about all of this? Let's continue the discussion on all of these five topics in the uh, uh, comment section below. Again, Austin and Berlin coming this year to limited production. Do you believe that? Austin and Berlin's one year production to be similar to Shanghai's one year uh, production, uh, which was impressive. Do you, what do you think about that? And uh, that they have a confidence that Tesla will deliver 1.5 million vehicles in 2022. And what do you think about that? Cybertruck on, top, on track for 2022 start with uh, production and deliveries, battery capacity permitting. What do you think about that? Capacity uh, expansion required will be in Shanghai, Austin and Berlin.
Berlin expansions plus new locations. What do you think about new locations? Where do you think Tesla will build its next gigafactory? This is Armin Haryan from Talk News. Please subscribe to our channel for cool Tesla electric vehicle discussions every day, several stories a day, and ring the bell so you don't miss my next coverage. God bless you, everyone. Peace be with all of you, and let's move on to our next Tesla story. If you found this report helpful, please like it. I would greatly appreciate it.